what does this Bearcat wireless microphone and this ICOM 7300 have in common? Stick around. Find out. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Ryan Casey 9 OZA. So what does this Udian Bearcat wireless microphone have to do with this ICOM 7300? Well, you can use them together. I was searching on eBay and I stumbled across this adapter from W2ENY. Check him out on eBay. He makes this adapter. This end is a Udian style plug. And this end hooks up to your ICOM 7300 or any other ICOM radio that uses this style microphone jack. And what it allows you to do is he made it so it works with this microphone and it allows you to plug this adapter into your radio plug the microphone into the radio and you can listen to your net and even check into the net all through this microphone I've tried it I'll show it here in the video in a second but all you got to do is hook it up, sync the microphone here to the base that comes with it, and then the volume will play through this speaker here. There's your microphone. I tried it out a little bit today. Uh, my shack is separate from my house, and I took this in the house with me because this microphone comes with a belt clip. Had it on. Found a net, went in my house, probably about 40 feet away, and it has five to six walls in between me and my radio, and it never did drop out. This is a Bluetooth style microphone. So we'll go ahead and hook it up and show you how it works. Okay, so here we got it hooked up. One thing I did forget to mention is on his website you only get this adapter cable the microphone part here you have to buy separate which I picked this one up it was used on eBay for roughly forty dollars I don't remember how much this was exactly for sure again you can check out his store on eBay W2ENY and so I got the radio fired up here you can hear some rag chewing going on. So the microphone's not currently on. All I have to do is you can tell that the radio is powering the bass here. So all I have to do is push the bear claw sync button. You'll see it flash a couple times. And there it's synced up. It does still play the sound through this speaker as well as this speaker. So I had to kind of finesse the volume here. This has a volume on the side here. I turned it down and then turned this one up just enough to where you can start to hear it on here. And then if you need to turn it up more, you can push the up and down button. Well, there you can hear it. And we'll get away from the radio here so you can hear it a little bit better. And we'll see how far away this will actually go. Like I said, I've used it about 40 feet roughly through five walls. I'm going to take it outside with me and just see how far away I can walk from the shack before it cuts out. So we'll go ahead and we'll go outside. Now, it's not that bad. Well, I can hear every word you say it just fine. But it'll be interesting to find out where it's coming from if it's coming in on the power. 
So here I am. I'm roughly about 80 feet from my house outside. So I have two walls blocking me. One in is my aluminum sided on my garage. And it's still coming in crystal clear. Some guys rag chewing on here. So, great little unit. Uh, if you want to be able to walk around your shop or around your house and listen to it, net as well as check in, I'll try to find somebody on here and see if they can't give us audio check to see how the microphone does sound. Well, I was able to talk to some guys down in Georgia on it. I had to turn my mic gain up and mess with it a little bit, so you may have to finesse your settings a little bit to get it to work, but it does work. So, check it out. Again, this adapter is from W2ENY on eBay. And this is just the Udian Bearcat Bluetooth microphone. Thanks everybody for watching. 73.